Welcome back to another reaction. Welcome back to another trailer reaction. It's just the three of us today, and we have ladies' love, Andre. Who's Hello. Not feeling well? I am not. Okay. I'm good. I'm good. Hello. <laughs> he went for a diagnosis on Google, so he should know by now when he's going to be able to recover. And we also have Sean. How are you doing? The man with the eyes. Howdy, people. Howdy, howdy. How you doing? Yeah, I'm good, man. Um, namaste. Um, you know, it's good back here to um, join in the fun for these reactions. And sorry to hear that ladies' love's not feeling well, man. Hopefully, you feel better soon. Um, yeah, maybe too many date nights. I'm not sure. <laughs> but <laughs> maybe I'm giving away a secret, but yeah. <laughs> So, so, so today I have two ill people with me. I have Ladies Love, who's ill with his health, and Sean, who's ill with his pride after Arsenal got beaten. So now we will be reacting to a trailer, a wonderful trailer. What we'll be reacting to today, Ladies Love? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, it's called Venhu Tanina Thafu Tada. Okay, we'll see. That's all right. Yeah. Directed by Gotham Vas Vasudev Menon, starring Silam Barasan, Sidhi Idani, among others. Now, it's about a low caste young star who comes to a big city for his, stud for his studies. And it revolves around him and his struggles for the identity for him and his low caste members. So that was on IMDb. I don't think that was written well, but yeah, that's what I wrote down. That's it. <laughs> Let's check it out. Sela samiya unmaya solra the kada solra the bade kashto. Idu oru unmaya na manushno da varka alive. Uchchi ke poga poga thani ma. मनुष्य सरिया <laughs> वो <laughs> யாரோ போக முடியாதானே இங்க பாரு நீ இங்க எந்த பெரிய விஷயத்துல ஈடுபடலனி வெய்ய உனக்கு ஒண்ணுமே தெரியலனி வெய்ய தப்பிச்சு போனா ஒருவேளை விட்டுருவாங்க திக்கத்தவங்க கூட தெய்வம் இருக்கும் தெய்வம் இல்லனா பே எங்க முடியும் துப்பாட்ல சார் பாட்டு பயணோ இவனுக்கு முடிவெப்ப இல்ல தொடரும் Okay. Hmm. Ladies love. I really like that. I really like the, um Yeah, I really like the trailer and I really want to watch that movie. It felt that my type of grittiness, that type of story of um people in that lifestyle, people um the poverty-stricken people and they get into that world 
it's not always the way, obviously, but I like watching it in terms of movies. Every, obviously, some people are poor. That doesn't mean they're going to get into crime. But in terms of movie stuff, I like that stuff and the gritty realities of it because some people do. And that looked good. And I liked um, the acting. I liked um, the trailer itself. Like, I liked what I was watching. And I liked... It just looked interesting to me. Um, yeah, I was just watching it. And I was like, yeah, I, I want to I wanna watch the movie. I really do. Yeah, it was good. Do you feel like it had, like, a um, film festival type of vibe to it? Say again, like, no. Do you feel like it had a Cannes Film Festival type of vibe to it? Yeah, right? it did. It did. And that's not always a good thing because sometimes they do that and it looks good and then you watch it and it's like, no, that wasn't all that. Mm. But I can only go by how I feel and I felt it and I liked it and I want to watch it. Yeah. No, fair enough. Um yeah, for me, it looked okay. Um, there was some uh, definitely, um, what would I say, I suppose, like passionate um, acting in there. Um, it looks like, you know, the story is clearly intense in relation to, um, you know, his life and um, circumstances. And then you saw it sort of unfold into violence, which, as Andre already alluded to, um, sometimes can be a reality when you're coming from poverty. So um, they definitely captured that in the trailer. Um, I thought that was um, done really well. Um, there was a, a punch scene, though, that I thought was a bit weak. I was like, really? You punch like that? It, I, don't, I don't know. Maybe it was just me, but I just saw one punch scene in it. I thought they could have done it a little When he was more. hitting him out of the room. Yeah, that. I, I don't know if it, it was just me again. Maybe you saw it. But it, it, was a sound e it was a sound effect. didn't match. It wasn't effective enough, yeah. I wanted to get because my, my watching it, mine was going back and forth. I couldn't see it properly, basically. So that's why yeah, I didn't know about that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, apart from that, that was the only little annoying thing. But yeah, I think, um, again, similar to Andre, I think they do a good job on the trailer. Um, so it would definitely be something that I would watch. And like I said, it definitely has that um, Cannes Film Festival vibe. So um, yeah, for me, can't complain. See, I'm kind of conflicted when I watch this because I kind of go, is it one of those films where you look at a trailer and you go, this trailer is really good. And then you watch the film and you go, what the hell? I was conned. The pace of the trailer was fantastic. I really liked it. Um, the acting was really good. You can't complain about that. Um, the instrumentals were good. Some of the sound effects were questionable. Like as um, Sean was saying, some of the punching, I thought it didn't match or it wasn't as powerful enough. I might get a little bit of criticism there, but that is my perspective on that. Would I watch this film? Yes, I would. It's it does give a film festival type of vibe. I kind of like the, the gritty way how it was filmed, the darkness to it. I do, but I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued to see how this develops more. And it's not something I would be the first person at, this, um, at the cinema to go and watch it. I wait to get some feedback and see what other subscribers say about it or what you guys have said about it before I decide whether I'll watch it. But based on the trailer, it's intriguing, but I'm not sure. The jury's out there for me. This was our reaction. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and share. If you're the first time checking out our channel, do check out our Patreon. We would appreciate that. And just smash the hell out of that red button that looks exactly like my jumper. Anyway, this is a Chatterbox crew. Bye for now. Peace.